You're watching surveillance video of a woman filling up her SUV. See how the silver car pulls up next to her like just another customer? Now watch. While the woman focuses on the gas pump, the crook crouches down, opens the passenger door, and grabs her purse. The entire crime took 19 seconds. You've just seen a slider at work. They say it's sliding because they're sliding below the, the eye level of the door. Here's another example. While a woman is inside the store, this car pulls up. A man checks the doors and takes a quick peek inside. The woman comes out, and while she's pumping gas, the man jumps through the driver's side window, grabs her purse, and is gone. She never noticed a thing. A vehicle is not a secure location for your property. Houston police officer Jim Woods says these crooks hit all parts of town, watching for women who leave their purses on the passenger seat, doors unlocked, and are distracted. Police say what these crooks are looking for is a common mistake. And that's thinking, I'm standing right next to my own car, so nobody would be crazy enough to try and break into my car while I'm standing next to it. That's exactly it. That's exactly what you're looking at. Wood says these burglaries can be stopped by women keeping their purses out of sight or taking their purse with them when they pump gas and always locking their doors, like Cindy Zenon, who goes a step further. I don't hold the pump. I usually click the... Um the, the holder on the pump so I can have time to actually scan what's going on around me. Andrea Kale says she does lock her doors, but leaves her purse out in the open. It should probably be, you know, in the glove compartment underneath the seat somewhere on my side versus the passenger side.